Hello everybody, welcome to a fantastic, another world famous coffee review from Hillbilly Select Reviews. I select coffees, teas, beers, wines, liquors, liqueurs. If you're a big boy and a big girl, I have the drink for you. Even if you don't like it, I have it for you. And why? Because you might have a friend that likes it. You may need to get ideas. You may be going over someone's house as a gift. You may be needing to give away a gift. And I explain all the flavors and all the cool stuff of every product under the sun that has to do with big boys and girls. Hosting a party, I got your wines. Going somewhere for dinner, I got your wines. Wanting to get into wine, wanting to get into beer, liquors, liquor, tequilas, bourbons, you name it, I've got it. Now, attached to this, the first comment in every one of my videos always has a link to the playlist that I'm reviewing. So in this one, my pinned first comment will have the link to my coffee reviews. What you do is you get a cup, you drink along with me. And then if you're still drinking a cup and stuff like that, you watch another video, okay? Because I need you to subscribe, I need the watch time, I need the thumbs up, and I need comments if you can do any or all those things. Subscription is the most important to me right now. And why do I need that? For the analytics to keep the place growing, channel growing, okay? Keep it alive. I don't need a dead channel. I don't need to talk to myself. I need to be motivated to keep buying stuff and doing the reviews for you. And that's all I ask in return. I don't have Patreon and any other crap. I don't ask for any money. It's just the things I mentioned. And I will do the rest. What are we doing, man? Private Selection, which is Kroger's brand, Kona Blend. Now, the Kona has a hole in it because it was a Keurig cup. But there it is. All right. Private Selection Kona Blend Ground Coffee is made from a premium all Arabica blend of hand select Hawaiian, I'll explain that in a minute, and Latin American coffee beans, um, cupped and chosen by Private Selection coffee experts for its consistently excellent flavors. Kona Blend is medium roasted in small batches and bagged immediately, blah, blah, blah. All right, so Kona comes from one side of a mountain. Okay, on the island of Kona in Hawaii. But you can call coffee Kona if it has a certain percentage. And I can't remember what that is. It has a certain percentage from that coffee because almost never, and people think they've had it. Like, they're like, I've had Kona coffee. No, you have not. You might, this doesn't even say it has it from, this just says it has it from Hawaii. Well, this is a specific part of Hawaii, a specific island, a specific mountain, and a specific side. It is extremely expensive. If you haven't paid a fortune, even if you have, it may not be true, but you didn't get it cheap. It's very expensive to get 100% Kona. I have had it, of course, and you can get it too, but you're going to pay for it. Um, you want 100%, you got to pay for it. Hawaii does make some great coffee, though. Remember, this is a mix of Hawaiian and Latin American. Anyway. Great coffee from Latin America. Great coffee from America that grows coffee. But Hawaii I particularly like, and especially on that uh, the Kona coffee. The real Kona coffee. All right. Here it is. Let's give it the sniff test. Oh, and if you do buy real, I don't even know if they put it in here. This is not what you want. <clears throat> you want to order it, have it ground. If you're going to pay for it, have it shipped fresh and enjoy it in a percolator, in a French press in some other style of making it to get the you're gonna pay for it you want to get the full experience just my opinion this is how you smell coffee see? all right well this has is, is it what i call a typical coffee smell medium roast medium smell uh, not always in this case uh, what i mean by that it, it's a great smell because it's the smell that i associate with a place, uh, especially a place that serves breakfast, whipping up all the pancakes and the eggs and the chatter and the noise and the coffee in the air brewing. And that's what it smells like. Pleasing with great memories for me. There it is. Let's give her a taste. So I always try and describe the acid. Is it real acidic? Which if, it, if your coffee is real acidic and you've bought some or you don't like it, put a pinch, and I mean a pinch, of salt. You don't want to make it where it's salty, but a little bit of salt will take out the bitterness. Boom, I just solved that problem for you, if that's a problem. 
I said the acid. There's bitterness too. That the salt will do the bitterness. The acid will be taken care of with this. Right, we'll get to that in a minute. So, you don't like that bitterness thing of coffee, or maybe your coffee's too bitter or whatever. Pinch of salt, pinch of salt mixed in nice. Problem solved. This is not real acidic, and it is, I'll say, medium, what I'll call bitterness on the back. But that'll let you know you're drinking a nice cup, right? You got a little bit of pizzazz to it. Um, overall, I'd say it's medium, medium in, in mildness or in, in strength. It's just a medium, good Kona blend. Nothing great, nothing bad, just it's solid. But I'm going to bring it up a notch. Yeah, I'm going to bring it up a notch. With my heavy cream, I put it in every cup. Every once in a while, I'll get to sipping in big sips, and it's not real hot. Next thing you know, it's gone. I didn't put the cream in. But I like to see how coffee holds up to it. This fat and this cream brings out flavor in coffee. It adds the, the, the feel, you know, the mouth feel. Um, adds a little flavor. Uh, just wonderful, wonderful. If you've not used heavy cream, you don't know what the hell you're missing. Use half and half, that's great. Use milk, that's yeah, all good. But it ain't as good as heavy cream, that's right. It just doesn't. Hmm. Signature smell, the heavy cream mixed with the coffee. That, my friends, is good. Held up well. Coffee did knock out the bitterness in the back. It wasn't that acidic uh, to begin with. Um, this would also calm that down. Okay, this milk and alkaline and all that is anti, I think, uh, acid. Um, but this didn't have it. And you want a little bit in there. You want to know you drink a damn cup of coffee. And here with the heavy cream, you know you are. It tastes like coffee. It came through, beautiful smell, mixed in with the beautiful smell of the cream, the vanilla. Um, a little bit of lactose added, a pinch of, um, and it, uh, of um, uh, what do you call, uh, sweetness, or at least perceived sweetness, because this says zero carbs, zero grams sugar, blah, blah, blah. And then it says less than one gram, it has a zero percent. So I think it could be up to, up to one or up to five. Maybe it's up to five, five or less, and they can call that uh, zero. Anyway, um, not a bad cup coming out of a Keurig. It's got a little bit of Hawaiian in there. Uh, a little bit of what they say, Latin American. Hmm. Convenient, pure cup, something different. I like to try different ones whenever I buy it uh, for work. Um, I mean, buy it for everybody at work. I always try and get something different every single time. Um, get everybody trying some new stuff, see what their new favorites are. Um, so I hardly ever drink the same thing twice. And I didn't even before the channel. Now with the channel, I really don't. I really don't hardly ever drink the same thing twice because I gotta keep reviewing different stuff for you. And what do you all have to do? Just sit back and relax and enjoy it. Yeah, but there's more. I told you, you gotta subscribe. You gotta hit the number one. If you can't subscribe, or if you can, you gotta hit the thumbs up. You gotta watch it. Okay, well, actually watching is number one. Subscribing is number two. Hitting the thumbs up and commenting is number three together because all those things help the analytics. It helps. The and push this video out it helps the channel grow and if it grows I stay motivated I stay doing this stuff I stay searching <laughs> far and wide to bring you these reviews which I hope you enjoy and um, and we all benefits the channel benefits I don't ask for money I don't ask for anything except for what I just asked for I'll do the rest I got no problem with the rest um, on these I love if you would um, Check out the playlist attached to this on the comment section and in the description of the video, either one. Uh, drink your coffee along with this. Check out the playlist for some unique stuff. And also check out, then check out my playlists. Not only the coffee one, but all the things that I review all broken down and see what looks good to you. I'm promising you there's stuff on there that you haven't thought about that's going to be uh, shocking all. All right? Till next time, I will see you all on the next one. Thank you.